Back in the YouTube video. Today, guys, I'm going to be talking about how, uh, if you heard about the new movie, Diary of the Wimpy Kid, The Long Haul, um, I'm basically going to do a rant about it and how it basically failed to make the movie. Now, the movie itself, I could enjoy, but there was just things that weren't right about the movie, and I wish they could have done, but unfortunately, they couldn't because, um... You know, some of the characters had gotten older and they had to change. Anyways, um, I wanted to do a video before the first my first day of school. So I still have like an hour or so till the first day of school. Well, until I have to go to school. But anyways, um, basically the first reason I just have to say about how this failed was that the characters sucked. Honestly, they didn't play very well. Now, if you look at the other movies, I'm going to put uh, Zachary Gordon, uh, who played as the old version of Greg. I think he played awesome. He always had his his looks were awesome. His voice, just it, it just went around. And I think they should have had him uh, the whole time. And they probably didn't even need to make the long haul. Um, they did make books, and I'm still re I still need to read two more. I need to read Old School and Double Down, which I will. I got both. I got every book. But nece not necessarily they didn't really need to make the long haul the movie. They didn't really need to make it. Um, but it was funny. It was very humorous. But just the characters were really, really off. Now, I can say one thing about Greg in this movie. My mom said that this Greg looked like he was in elementary school. So... Yeah, I was going around. Yeah, he did look like it. And then Rowley in the movie. When you first went to the movie, I mean, it was like you were reading the book because in the book, you know, everything was basically kind of the same as the book except the whole diaper hands thing and then, I don't know. But anyways, Rowley looked like he was in second grade. He literally looked like he was in second or first grade. So what the... This is what Rowley basically looked like, is he was smaller than me. He was, he just, he looked like he, he was so young. He looked like he was in second grade, is that what I can say? And the Greg looked like he was either going in fourth or fifth grade, so, like, really, the character, the ages it, were just off. And then Roderick, no offense, kind of looked like a doofus. No offense, he kind of looked like a doofus. And then the mom, I think the mom was a little more strict than usual. I mean, um, you know what they should have done? They should have brought Steve's on. They should have still had him as the dad, and they should have still, still had the other girl as the mom. But the children, the children couldn't have ch had to change because they are now, Roderick and Greg are now, they're just so old in real life. Um, like one's all grown up, he's like 20, and the other's probably the, one's like 20 and the other's like 17 or something like that. Anyways, I think the children are the only people who really had to change, but the mom and dad should have really changed because they did, everybody just played a bad role play to make it all fit. Now, there was some humor. New was message a humor from Ed. Movie. Like, let me just say, there were a ton of humor but some of the people in the movie, just no offense, kind of look like doofuses, really. Um, another thing bad about this movie is the... I just... Another thing bad about the movie is... Why did it have to be so like the book, though? You know what I mean? Uh, why And why couldn't they made this movie earlier? Like, why couldn't they have the movie in 2013 for the long haul and have all the same characters and do that? That's, that's why I'm thinking. And the dude who played it obviously was not the dude who made the actual books. I'm, I'm not thinking it's Jeff Kinney because he's the one who made the Diary of the Wimpy Kid movies. He directed them and he also uh, wrote the books. But anyways, why couldn't they made it earlier? Why did they have to wait? Uh, let me just think, five years when uh, the first three movies were just bunched up together 
for every year. Why couldn't they have just made it in 2013 and then they're over with the movies? I honestly don't think they should make any more. I think that it should have been the next year, the very next year, 2013, they should have made that long haul. All the same characters and it would have been done. It would have been great. It would have been a great movie. But instead they had to plunk it all the way into 2017 and then just ruin the characters. Um, crap, my phone keeps dropping. Anyways, I just think that this movie kind of sucked because most people think just the characters suck. And in general, why did we have to make this movie so far back when all the other movies were bunched together? You know what I mean? Um, I think some of the humor wasn't really, it was just child. It was a mature, it was an immature movie, kind of. If you think about it. There was another dude in the movie, he was like a gamer, and he didn't look right, man. He was always like, he's like, yeah, that's how you do it, that's how you do it. I mean, come on. that That's doofus number two. Let me just say, that's a doofus number two. But anyways, I think just the character. some of the characters were kind of annoying. Like the one dude I was just talking about, the gamer dude, he was the most annoying. Let me just say... Um, and then the acting was just so off. Um, like, the dude who's playing Manny, um, when he cried, it wasn't even a cry. It was a, it was like, eh and you couldn't even see his cry. Now, the Manny's in the other movie, I think he played a, a lot better, and I think he deserved, uh, what he got. This Manny sucked. I think just the cries, just they really, they really didn't fit with the thing. I didn't like this movie um, at all. I mean, I can enjoy it. It's just that there is a lot of, there is a lot of uh, things wrong with this movie. Um, like I said, the acting, the characters were just off. Um, and then, like I said, some of the characters just didn't look right. They were just, I don't know, I can't explain it. Um... And then, I don't, I just don't think they, really, the only way they could have made this movie right was either they don't make it, or they made it in 2013, and they could have had all the same characters, and like I said, it would be fine. It would be totally fine, we wouldn't have any uh, stuff wrong with it, I think it would be totally fine. So what do you guys think about this movie? I think it, I, I enjoy it. I watched it, um, I think Sunday, but still, I just didn't really, it was just off. Um, so like or subscribe, guys. I'll see you next time.